Ito yung sinasabi. <laughs> May mga evidence. Pero, napaka-blurry. Hello guys! Welcome ulit sa ating channel, ang Tito Manong TV. At sa video natin ngayon, gagawa tayo ng isang reaction video tungkol sa 10 Believe Extinct Animals na sabi nila, buhay pa pala. So, let's start the video. Since time began, over 5 billion species of animals have become extinct. But evidence suggests that some extinct animals may still be with us today. There have been sightings of animals which have been said to have gone extinct thousands or millions of years ago. And many have even been caught on very convincing mm. videos. <laughs> Woolly Mammoth it said that woolly mammoths went extinct in 2000 BC. They were like gigantic furry elephants with tusks. They stood over 11 feet tall and weighed nearly 7 tons. And they did actually live among humans for many years. This includes the ancient Native Americans, and also some ancient Eurasian people. But over thousands of years, they went extinct. This was partly because of humans hunting them for meat, and also climate... Yung pagka-depiction ng mga woolly mammoth sa mga movies, cartoons, parang ang laki-laki nila, no? Pero lately ata, parang may isang nahukay na woolly mammoth. Hindi naman siya ganun kalaki. Mas malaki pa yung mga African elephant natin kesa woolly mammoth. Siguro from the term nila na mammoth, ibig sabihin sobrang laki. Pero in reality, 11 feet ang taas, 7 tons. Hmm, hindi ko lang alam kung anong mas mataas or mas mabigat. Pero yung sa... Uh, nakita sa isa, ibang YouTube video na isang woolly mammoth na nahukay, hindi siya ganun kalakihan. Pero sabi nila, bata pa daw yun. Pero hindi siya yung gaya ng parang gigantic na parang dinosaur yung laki ng isang woolly mammoth. Parang similar or mas maliit lang konti sa yung mga African elephant. So ano yung video na sinasabi nagpapatunay or I mean proof nila buhay pa daw ang ano, woolly mammoth? climate change over thousands of years. The last known woolly mammoths passed on 10,000 years ago. These were found in Siberia. These were the final mainland woolly mammoths. But other groups of woolly mammoths have been found on islands much more recently. They lived on Wrangell Island in the Arctic Ocean until 4,000 years ago. In 2012, it was believed a woolly mammoth was caught Wait, Yan? on camera. The animal appeared to walk through this Siberian river. But the person filming it did not want to get to... Yun lang yung ano ko dito. Ang parang... Ang masasabi ko dito. Una, blurry ang camera. Anong year to nakuha? Kasi pag mayroong isang ganitong klaseng event o pangyayari na nakuha mo, always blurry ang camera. Tapos pag titingnan mo ng maigi, para siyang isang grizzly bear na may kagat-kagat na isda or salmon. 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 Okay? So, mm, not convincing. Not convincing na isa tong huli mamot. Para lang sa akin, ha. Kung iba yung opinion nyo, sa inyo yun. Okay? Too close. As late as 1948, frozen woolly mammoths have been found. And this raised the possibility that some may still be alive in Siberia today. Black Leopard For over 100 years, it was believed that black leopards had gone extinct. But recently, a new photo of one has been caught. In 2019, a photographer had the first sighting of a black leopard in 100 years. The image was caught by... Ano ang kaibahan ng black leopard sa black panther? Pa, ang black panther may movie. Hmm. <laughs> De, medyo ano lang ko kung anong kaibahan nila. <laughs> I will Barad Lucas in Kenya. He shared these amazing photographs proving that the animal is not extinct. Kenyans had shared rumors of black leopards walking around at night for a long time. But thanks to these amazing photos, their existence has been proven. Tasmanian Tiger the Tasmanian tiger is also known as the thylacine. They were being hunted as they were a threat to livestock. And as land was being built on, their habitats got smaller and smaller. They officially became extinct in 1936. But some... Ginawan to ng movie eh. Uh, anong tawag doon? 
Basta ang bida si William Dafoe, yung about Tylosin or Tasmanian Tiger. Hindi ko lang ma-remember kung anong tawag sa movie. Pero ginawan to ng movie about sa finding sa ganitong mga extinct uh, creature or animals. Pero minsan naman talaga, may mga animals na declare nila na extinct. Pero in some later years, meron pa pala. So, hindi pa siya talaga final pag may declaration na extinct na to, extinct, extinct na yan. Pero, meron pa pala. Maliban na lang siguro sa mga prehistoric animals talaga, like mga dinosaurs, saka yung ibang mga ano prehistoric na mga animals or creatures. Sightings of them in Australia are fairly common. They've been spotted in Tasmania and mainland Australia. Recently, fencing workers in Lang Lang reported a Tasmanian tiger roaming around one morning. And as late as 2003, there is a suspected video... Yan. Ito yung sinasabi mo. <laughs> May mga evidence. Pero, napaka-blurry. Pwede maging fax, maging kayo. But sadly, HD cameras were not the norm back then. So it's hard siguro, to see what this exactly is. Kasi siguro noon, wala pang HD, tapos napakalayo. So, pixelized pa. Uh, so far, yung black leopard pa lang yung medyo klaro talaga yung pictures na yun talaga. Pero ito, hmm. But combine this with all the reported sightings, and I think it's safe to say Tasmanian tigers may still roam the world with us. Pero hindi naman impossible, kasi na declare sila, I think uh, mid 19 something, kasi yung last video yung 1936 eh. So may possibility talaga na meron pang mga ganito uh, hindi lang nagpapakita sa tao, kasi sa pagkakaalam ko nocturnal ang mga animals na to. Ibig sabihin masigla sila sa gabi. Nagahant sila sa gabi pag umaga tulog sila nakatago. Beiji. Ha? Huh? This is also known as the Yangtze River Dolphin. Ay, oh. These dolphins used to be very common, but they were doomed after the Three Gorges Dam was built. This increased Nakita the number of boats in the river a lot. And in 2006, the Chinese dolphin was declared extinct. But one year later, there was a sighting of them confirmed by scholars. Scientist and expert Wang Ding confirmed this sighting. This led to a massive expedition to try and find more. Researchers traveled more than 2,200 miles. But unfortunately, they had no further sightings. But the Yangtze River is very long and there's lots they did not cover. So there's a chance there are more Beijing dolphins out there today. Japanese Wolf Ooh. These amazing wolves, native to Japan, went extinct in 1905. This was known as the world's smallest wolf. It Aww. measured only 35 inches and stood about one foot tall. But although it was declared extinct in 1905, images of this wolf were found from 1910. Also, traces of these wolves continue to be found to this day. And there are various sightings from Japanese islands. So perhaps this wolf could still be alive today. There have been sightings of this wolf in the 1930s, 50s, and even the 90s. Many also report a strange howling noise in certain Japanese woods. They believe this could be the Japanese wolf or maybe a dog-wolf hybrid. Because the Japanese countryside is so vast, we may never know. But many researchers and explorers remain optimistic and search for this wolf to this day. Mokiel Mbembe You may never have heard of this animal before. It's an ancient African water-dwelling creature. It's said to have gone extinct 65 million years ago. It's a reptile but has an abnormally large neck and tail. It lives deep in the... So itong creature to, Moke Mbembe? <laughs> Sorry, hindi ko ma-pronounce siguro. Parang nabildo ko na siya sa cryptid na kategory sa animals. Kasi may mga cryptid creatures like yung mga Bigfoot, Uh, yung mga Loch Ness Monster, Sasquatch, ano pa ba? Yun. Ito parang cryptid na ito eh. Congo River Basin of Central Africa. Its dinosaur subgroup is a sauropod. And its unusual name means one who stops the flow of rivers. 
That's because many say it was so wide it could stop the river flowing. In 2012, someone was taking photos of the basin from a helicopter. That's when they saw what they believed to be this extinct animal. Others believe that this animal lives in other parts of the world. Yeah. For example, many say that the sightings of the Loch Ness Monster in Scotland could be this animal. Also in 1959, it of the Loch Ness Itong picture na to na, ano na to eh, na debunk? Isa itong laruan na pinicture ng isang dentist ata. Kasi makikita mo na yung laki ng dinosaur, hindi siya nagmamatch sa ripples ng water. Yun yung explanation. Tapos, yung ano talaga, yung nagpicture talaga nito is umamin talaga na hindi to nag exist It's just a hoax or bali, parang prank lang nila. ba diba? Pero is it? Hindi natin alam. Pero kung ako ang tatanungin, may point, ang ripples talaga ng tubig. Ito yung parang Loch Ness Monster nila. I mean, yung Loch Ness Monster, itong picture na to ang nagpakalat na may Loch Ness Monster. Okay? Pero so yung sa Africa, iba naman. Loch Ness Monster in Scotland could be this animal. Also in 1959, it was reported that a pygmy tribe caught and ate one of these animals. Do you think these million-year-old lost creatures could still be among us today? Javan Tiger Mm. The Javan tiger is native to the Indonesian island of Java, but over the years, the island's inhabitants needed food, so they hunted and ate these tigers. This led to them being declared extinct in 1976, but there were many sightings of these in the 1980s. In the 90s, explorers did a massive search of the island. In 1994, they completed the search, saying that they were indeed extinct. But in 1995, this was proved wrong. That was when a Javan resident accidentally discovered a group of Javan tigers. Up until today, there have been many sightings of these animals. Javan tigers' waste matter and hair has been found all over the island. The last confirmed sighting was in the year 2000. But many Javans still believe that these tigers live on the island. Eastern Cougar In 2011, the Eastern Cougar was said to be extinct. But even after 2011, there have been many sightings on every single East Coast state of the USA. Recently in New Hampshire, a couple saw this cougar and took a photo. And many believe that these still exist in the wilderness today. Ivory-billed woodpecker This amazing bird was declared extinct in the 1920s. But since then, there have been 15 sightings of this bird. The most recent one was in 2005 in Arkansas. Scientists and bird experts are divided over whether this bird is alive or extinct. But many do believe the ivory-billed woodpecker is still flying to this day. Mexican Grizzly Bear In 1964, it was declared that this amazing bear was extinct. But since then, there have been many reported sightings of Mexican grizzlies in Mexico and Colorado, USA. A study 15 years after they were extinct found marks and footprints from these bears. And the study also found that Mexico and Colorado were suitable habitats for these bears. Japanese River Otter In 2012, these otters were declared extinct. But since then, there have been more than 15 sightings of this animal. These are normally in areas where they wouldn't tend to be, for example, polluted rivers. But some believe they may live here because of the easy food source, which is garbage. <laughs> passenger Pigeon There used to be 5 billion passenger pigeons, but in 1914, they were declared extinct. That was until the US President Theodore Roosevelt spotted one. Since then, flocks of these birds have been seen all over the USA, and many believe that they're still flying to this day. But now it's time to make your voice heard. Comment below whether you think any of these animals may still be alive today. If you want some more amazing videos, then check out my second channel. But as always, thanks for watching. So ang take ko dito, siguro yung iba buhay pa. I mean, meron pang nag exist maliban dun sa mga cryptid, like yung sa kanina, sa Loch Ness Monster or sa parang dinosaur or mammoth. Pero kayo, anong take nyo? Kasi marami pa talagang extinct animal na diniklare na extinct, pero lately na discover nila na meron pa pala. Okay? So, kung bago lang kayo sa channel ko, please like, share, and subscribe. At kung may tanong kayo or may comment about my future content, please comment down below. At 
ilalagay ko din ang link ng channel na ito sa description below kung gusto nyo uh, mag-subscribe sa channel na ito. At syempre, kita-kits on my next video.